So the next fantasy cast we're going to take a look at is the Rally Cat. The Rally Cat came out in 2017, was the original version. Uh, this particular version, I'm not sure if it's 2017 or not. I think it's 2018, but I don't really know. I've got a couple variations. Uh, this one being my favorite because those gold wheels just really stand out. Uh, the base code on it is DTX15, if anybody's interested. And up to now, there are six different variations that are available. The designer was Dmitry Shakmatov, I guess is how you say it. Sounds Russian to me. Uh, it doesn't really say much about where or why they designed it the way they did. Uh, in fact, it doesn't say anything on on their Wikipedia, whatever. Uh, but it's definitely a rally car. It's got that rally car style and characteristics. Uh, it actually makes me think of the Ford RS200, which was a mid-engine four-wheel drive sports car produced by Ford Europe from 84 to 86. Uh, the RS200 was based on Ford's Group B rally car and was designed to comply with the FIA regulations of the day, which required at least 200 of those be built and offered up to the public. Uh, that Group B rally car class only lasted from 82 to 86, but uh, it's a pretty good read if you ever want to check into it. The horsepower basically doubled. They had very few restrictions uh, back then, so a lot, of, a lot of manufacturers were jumping in there, but they had a lot of accidents, and finally it, it earned the moniker of uh, the Killer Bees. So. It didn't last very long, but it was cool. And that's what make this casting makes me think of. So I have no idea if that's what they were thinking when they built it. But I'm going to put a picture of this, this RS200 up. Tell me if you think maybe that's what they were thinking. Or if I'm just crazy. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, leave a comment. Tell me what you think. We'll see y'all in the next video.